Hello, hello. Thank you for tuning in to the next um, bonnet vlog. Um, so I haven't had a bonnet vlog in a while. It's been, I think, about a month. So I just wanted to pop in and give you some updates and give you uh, the next bonnet vlog. Um, so first of all, thank you for um, watching the video. Thank you for being part of the MP Trust Treats family. Thank you for tuning in. Thank you for everything. Thank you for being on this journey with me um, next month probably when this video goes live it'll be uh, October 2021 and it will be the official fifth year anniversary of MP Trust Treats and I want to thank you so much for being on the um, the small business hopefully big business journey with me and I appreciate you so much for being here um, so like I said it is gonna be the fifth year anniversary for MP Trust Treats and as part well I guess not as part of the fifth year anniversary but um, I was recently featured in um, a magazine called shout out LA so check it out uh, check out the article I will put the link to the article in the caption below this video excuse me my throat is uh, bothering me so I will um, put the link in this video um, in the caption of this video so there's a few things I wanted to talk about uh, in this episode of the bottom blog one of course is the five-year anniversary of NP dress treats um, two is wholesale uh, how wholesale works um, I also wanted to talk about um, the last giveaway and some upcoming giveaways that I'm going to be doing um, caring for your satin treats and um, I wanted to talk about oh, returns, refunds, even though no one ever really um, reached out to me about refunds, returns, etc. Uh, some people do message me about a product that has had an issue and depending on how long you've had that product and really depending on how you come at me, I will definitely um, replace it or figure out how to fix your product. So I want to talk about that. And then... Um, talk about uh, the importance of referrals, the importance of newsletters, and oh, a helper that I had um, didn't really go over too well. And let's see. Oh, special requests. I want to talk about that. And then, um, yeah, so let's get started. Oh, also, I am wearing the bird, Hummingbirds of Paradise um, I don't think I have really I think I have one left in stock in the regular size so um, yeah and I might have a few BABs left I gotta check to see um, if I have any more of those so if you would like the birds of paradise just shoot me an email and I will uh, make sure that is available if I have it in stock so let's get started okay so I recently did a few giveaways and I like to do giveaways to give people the opportunity to win some treats I also like to do giveaways um, just to say thank you for following and supporting Epi Dress Treats the last giveaways I did was a superhero giveaway and you had to list um, what your superpower would be if you could have a superpower and okay really quickly I don't know what the noise is I think someone's vacuuming in their house I wanted to do this outside I just I didn't want to be inside like I get so tired of being inside of my office so I wanted to um my little notes blow away I wanted to be outside for this bonnet vlog so please forgive me for all the outside extra noises but I really did want to be outside because I'm always inside, always sitting in front of the sewing machine, you know? So I wanted to be outside, so forgive me for all the extra noises and then whatever that noise is there. So anyway, back to the blog. So I did, um, like I said, a superhero giveaway and a back to school giveaway. On the superhero giveaway, I gave away a bottle of That's That Magic and um, a uh, red, white, and blue shower cap. It, um, it was right on the outside, blue and white stars on the inside. And the, there was two winners for that. And the winners were Deep Within and Miss Kita 86. So those were two winners for that giveaway. And then I did a back to school giveaway where I gave away a pineapple backpack and a, um, 
a pineapple backpack and a, um, a pineapple noir bonnet. And the two winners were, for that were Rachel Monet and um, Donnie Savik. I hope I said your names right. So those were the two uh, winners for the giveaway. So thank you for everyone that entered. I will be having some awesome giveaways coming up for the fifth year anniversary. I'm going to be giving away one of the um, Whimsy bonnets, which is like the, um, it has like the tool on the outside with like the flowers. I did a very, very limited edition release of that bonnet. Um, currently right now in mint, I'm going to be giving away a peach one. So stay tuned for that giveaway. I'm also going to be giving away, um, by the time this video goes live, the giveaway will probably be live. It's going to be a, um, a Starbucks print giveaway. And I'm going to do a bunch more giveaways for pretty much the end of, like from now until the end of the year for the fifth year anniversary. Also, October's my birthday month. So I'm going to be giving away some uh, giveaways for my birthday month, for the fifth year anniversary, for like 12 days of giveaways around Christmas time a whole bunch of giveaways I'm gonna be doing so stay tuned for the giveaways okay so I wanted to talk to you all about caring for your treats it is so 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 important that you properly care for your um, satin treats I have to write something down really quickly um, okay oils break down elastic right and what something that I've been learning over time is in doing this business is that oils break down elastic so if you're like oiling your edges or your scalp at night or morning whenever and you're not washing your treat your treats that oil is staying in your bonnet and breaking down your elastic meaning your bonnet's not gonna last as long or your scrunchies not gonna last as long so it's very important that you wash and care for your treats you know um very important that's why like some people will send me a picture of their bonnet and it's like i mean super stretched out which my bonnets never get like that and most customers don't their bonnets don't get like that and i think over time and not caring for your bonnets and not washing them um they tend to stretch out that way they start to smell bad um and they just they don't last so it's very very important that you're washing your bonnets um just like you wash your hair right like you don't want to have a dirty bonnet on clean hair it just doesn't work that way so make sure you're like making an effort to wash your bonnets and your scarves the same day that you're washing your hair right um just bonnet hair maybe while your deep conditioner is on put your bonnet in the you can wash it in the laundry bag you can throw it in the sink let it hang to dry um either way it it it's very important that you wash your stuff. Um, what else? I recently, <laughs> I recently had someone message me about some products they purchased in 2018. Definitely grateful for them um, purchasing products in 2018 uh, because that's closer to when I was starting my business. And you know, I was a new business, so I definitely appreciated the early on support. They did reach out to me about their scrunchies. Um, stretching out and um it was 2018 and we are at the end of 2021 and i can't send you new scrunchies and a new bonnet when you've had your products for over three years um like i said if you know you've had your bonnet for like two months and you're having some issues even scrunchies i happily will replace that product for you right um if it was like my fault i mean not if you just like ran it over with your car threw it in the blender did some something you know off the wall obviously you're not gonna throw it in the blender you're not gonna run over with your car but if you do something just out there i'm not gonna replace it but if you know it's something that is my fault i will definitely make it right as much and and it all depends on how you reach out it's so important what i think people don't understand is how you talk to people is very important kindness will get you way farther than being an asshole will sorry to say asshole but just don't be an asshole kindness gets you way farther and gets you way more than being a jerk um so yeah so if you've had your scrunchies from 2018 i'm sorry i cannot replace your scrunchies from 2018 it's just very important also that like you wash them i mean sometimes just people just don't take care of their stuff and i can't replace something that hasn't been cared for well regardless if you bought it in 2018 i can't replace it but um i just i can't replace something that just hasn't been taken care of you know especially when like i'm constantly like hey take care of yourself i send care for instructions so it's very important that you care for your stuff 
um, wanted to talk to you about the importance of referrals. So I don't know if you've like, if you've been with me or if you've been on Instagram, social media for a long time, you know, like social media used to go by, um, the order of it was posted. Right. And then that algorithm changed, which is totally fine. Whatever. Um, then it changed and now and then it goes by it went by i don't know what these algorithms are but it changed from that algorithm to something else and then to something else and to something else and then now they're really pushing instagram is really pushing reels which i hate reels do you hate reels i hate reels um who has time for that so um it's very important that you uh, sign up for the newsletters that you refer people that you post and that you tag and be sure to when you're you know when you're bonnet even if you're not wearing your bonnet just to show your hair from um how it looks when you're protecting your hair sleeping on your side pillowcase your scrunchies your scarves anything that i can repost or um, and that you're referring and that you're signing up for the newsletter so it's very important that you do that for myself and other small businesses as well because um these like social media platforms so, uh, although they've helped businesses grow they're really making it difficult for the continued growth of small businesses okay oh today which today as i'm recording this video uh but it's not gonna be today when you find out um i released the fall bonnet batty box and if you sign up for the bonnet batty box newsletter then you got the password to purchase your bonnet batty box early before um, everyone else gets to purchase and that's like the importance of newsletters i mean there i have several different newsletters for different things right like the overall general newsletter and then i have like the bonnet batty box newsletter i'm also starting a subscription box which i cannot wait for you guys to see um once that newsletter goes live you have to sign up for it so you can get like the early deets on that um what else? oh i wanted to talk to you guys about so if you've noticed i've been having more and more um items in the imperfectly perfect collection so about six months ago i hired um like a helper to help me so and like her first batch of items were pretty good well she did a batch of products for me um that the quality was like absolutely shitty and i can't sell them like i can't there's no way i could sell them for full price so i will i have posted a lot of them on the imperfectly perfect collection i'm continuously posting every day items on the imperfectly perfect collection so keep an eye out for that if you want some of the imperfectly perfect stuff i mean it's the the integrity of the product is great it's just not up to my standards as far as quality and i cannot sell you some products that aren't up to my quality of standards so yeah so keep an eye out for that um but yeah so she basically messed up a lot of my fabric she actually kept some of my fabric she kept quite a bit of my tags um and tags aren't cheap neither is fabric and it really pissed me off but whatever um there's really nothing i could do about it so yeah so there's that i also wanted to talk about um special requests and custom orders so a custom order is is when you have like um you want to put like your logo you want to put a picture something like that on a pro on um fabric and then i make the piece of um the item a special request is when you want like say like pac-man which i did some pac-man bonnets last week so um that's like a that's a special request so those are the differences between special requests and custom requests so often i will post a picture of the special request on the page to show you the types of items that um or the item that i made with that print and i will not be selling it but i post it to show you like i mean the op your options are endless so that's the reason i post it um even though i won't be selling it i know some of you message me like i want that i want that like you're posting it but you're not selling it yeah because i can't um i can't add every special request to the store like if it's very very popular then i will add it to the store but if it's you know like one off like one or two people message me and say they want to purchase it then i i um then 
I'll just I can sell it to them via the special request link but I will not be adding it to the store and um, yeah so that's yeah so basically like and I've kind of learned my lesson on that with um, doing that with adding things to the store because people have messaged me like hey I really want that I really want that and then they don't purchase it and then I'm stuck with all of this extra fabric so yeah um, I think that is it like my throat is like oh, kind of scratchy but yeah so just to kind of wrap up um, oh I did have a little pro tip for you uh, after you take off your bonnet if you like massage your scalp and um it gives you more volume so that is it sorry right, i'm kind of dry today i just kind of i've been kind of in like this little funk and i've been really trying to shake it for like the past like two weeks so um oh really quickly wholesale wholesale orders i typically um only do wholesale orders with like salons or stores and um the prices for wholesale start at $14.50 and it says start at because it starts at $14.50 and that's basically um like I get to select the what you will have in your store you know the price goes up depending on like what you want in your store so that's just like a quick wholesale so um I'm kind of done because my throat's scratchy and but I wanted to show you what's underneath my bonnet because I like to in um, I like to close out the bonnet blog with what's underneath the bonnet so um, I did this cool little twist out by accident but I'm loving it so here we go so I did a little twist out and actually I'm wearing an edge scarf. I um, don't make them anymore, but I found an old edge scarf. Now I do um, satin headbands, which I use the same thing for. I mean, I use to do the same thing to like lay my edges, but I'm wearing a, a, a edge scarf. So. so yeah, so this is the, this is the, twist out I did so yeah and then this is the hummingbirds of paradise bonnet so yeah so thank you for watching I'm sorry again if I was like so dry I'm just kind of trying to shake this funk and my throat's all scratchy and yeah but thank you for watching don't forget to like and subscribe love y'all bye